get the checkout page with bricks ultimate here i am creating one first i am creating a checkout page and using the class classic checkout edit uh, shortcut on this page we shall not create this page with the bricks editor next we shall assign this checkout in woocommerce settings so it is pointing with the woocommerce checkout functionality so here is the checkout page we shall add our checkout page here and save the changes now we shall create the checkout template in bricks i already created a template this woocommerce checkout so i am going to this i create a title then select the template type is checkout woocommerce checkout and editing this template with the bricks editor i add a container and add two columns layout here i am contact information i shall add the deliver information and third is billing information so first contract information i shall add the billing add uh, email id so bricks ultimate had billing field element shall so select the email field next i am copying this element and i shall add a create account checkbox you can if you want to by default it is checked then we shall use this option checked by by default next i am adding my delivery information section it should be my shipping information so first we shall add the shipping address selector element here by default this element is showing the radio buttons here we do not need the radio button so here is the option disable the radio buttons i am labeling this under this section we shall add the shipping fields here is our shipping fields element enter first name last name street address country then state and pin code We can also use the column layout so we can add a block and use the two columns layout
put the first name and last name here this is our design for the billing information sections now we shall create the billing information sections so I am adding the billing address selector element and here we need the two radio buttons so we are keeping this design now we shall add the fields shall add the billing fields so here is the element billing element adding the first name duplicating it last name address country town state Next state Sorry, I oh yeah, this is being filled. So state country. Next is pin code. Street, country, region, town, and 
current state it is due to the state address sorry okay next i added the cart content element here then we place the content updater element this is also coming from the bricks ultimate then under this content updater i put the cart cost subtotal cart cost semi element choose the shipping and cart cost showing the total value here next i added the shipping methods we can customize the design here then payment methods and our place order button element is here now this is our look so now i am saving this template and going to the our checkout page because i already add a item in the cart so i am getting my checkout page and this is and if we submit the form then we'll see the error message because I did not check this option if we also use the different billing function and did not put the information we also get the alert message here and same it is will also show here we can edit this design based on the bidding field address in line message sections font size 12 and set color red if we refresh the space and submitting the form we can see the error message here and same is here also but by hook or any uh, or the brick settings we can hide this error message and just keep this error message here now we are choosing the same as shipping address we can also change this text like billing address here you can change the text of these two radio buttons first one so we can change same as delivery address or use a different billing address and refreshing the page now we are keeping this and same as delivery address submitting the order order is posted and going to the back end WooCommerce orders and this is our new orders and we can see that our billing address and shipping address are here and both are same this is the one kind of functions and another we can also test here is another one we can 
and set change the shipping information free direct banking and choose the and placing this order also of this is here is not billing phone so we can do this misc and here we can unregister this field is submitted and going to the commerce orders and here is the another order and our billing and shipping address are different so this is, is working perfectly and we can get this kind of checkout with bricks and bricks ultimate add-on